Diddy. It's crashing down. Brother Love's crashing down right now. Brother Love is going down. It's, it's going down. First it was with the QVD and all that shit they done. Now they eat. Uh, What's going on with Diddy, man? What's going on with Brother Love? Man, man so breaking news, man. Um, When y'all see this, man, I'm sure, man, y'all be like, damn, man, it's crazy. But, yeah, man, not only do Diddy got, or Brother Love got, you know, going on with the whole, you know, Keefe D stuff. Uh, you know, Keefe D with the, you know, Tupac murder and all that. Keefe D said that Diddy sponsored, you know, the murder. You know what I'm saying? That's, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't snitching on this shit. It's 30 years old and it's out shit there from the nigga that said it. That was in the car. 20 years, man. Yeah, the dude, that dude that was in the car, he said this. So, he, and he been saying this. You know what I'm saying? This ain't, you know what I'm saying? He been saying this thing from, since probably like 2012. No, he been saying this forever. But when he gave his statement, it was like 2012. But... Yeah. Outside of that, him saying that Diddy sponsored this bag, and, you know, you know, this bag on uh on Pac Head and Sugarhead, you know, Diddy over there sweating bullets. Cassie comes out, man. You know, Cassie comes out the woodworks and says that she well presses a, a, a lawsuit for thirty million dollars, bro, for rape and, and assault, bro. Like, damn. Bro. But I'm like, damn, the shit was so far back. But I'm like, thirty million, bro. Man, that's crazy. They ain't been together in like ten plus years. Like, now you I know be, I be so confused with stuff like this because it's like when you go back and sue a nigga for thirty m's and y'all ain't been together for twelve to fifteen years. It's crazy to me. Like, yeah, you know, like that time is expired to me now. Whatever went on, no, nah, it ain't expired on. Like, it's, it's man, this expired. is expired. Yeah. Look, but, so but. Only reason that I, you know, I know the little shit about that. Only reason that she is not a legal, is not a criminal, is because you know the statute of limitations done passed on that shit. Damn, show her. So the only thing you can go for right now is the bag. Man, you gotta have some hurt in you, man, to go twelve to fifteen years later and sue a motherfucker for some shit so long ago. This shit was in the early two thousands, my G. Yeah. Not early two thousands. Yeah, it was like oh five, five but no, it ain't the early two thousands, nigga. Oh five is early. Oh. Nigga, we's going to, nigga. I mean, y'all tap in in the chat and let me know if that's the early 2000s, nigga, 05, nigga. But, but that's crazy, man. It's like brother 06 Love, or something like bro. that. Like, you know what? I had a fishy feeling about it, man, because I was seeing Brother Love out there overseas. He had his feet in the sand. And when I see niggas putting too much sand between their toes, I know something going to go wrong. Yeah, man. He was too comfortable out there. It's not only just that, though, man. It's just that it's a lot of, like, Things just like, I don't know why it's coming down on Diddy like this right now, man, but it's a lot of things just coming out, just the woodworks on a lot of niggas, but on Diddy right now, just a lot of things that, you know, have been rumors for a while, now it's coming to the forefront again, you know what I'm saying? Like, and it's sticking, I ain't gonna say it's sticking, but it's damn near like, we in a time right now where if you, you know what I'm saying, if you can, you know what I'm saying, you got a phone. If you got a phone, you can. You ain't got to wait on it like back in the day. You ain't got to wait on a publicist or wait on a newspaper to publish this shit or, or a magazine. Nice. You can get on, go live and put your story out there. You know what I'm saying? And that's where we at right now because it's like not only do that, you got everybody that's giving their two cents on it. You got, uh, what's little girl uh, from Danny DK, man? Yeah, I, I see her. Like, they, they, you know, it was basically... Aubrey O'Day. Aubrey O'Day. Yeah. And, no, and, no, not and, only and that. And the one that he had the group with, too. She had came out yeah. and support, yeah. too. Oh, Duh. girl. But no, what I'm saying, though, you know, Aubrey O'Day had made claims back in the day as well. So yeah. her whole thing is like, I told y'all, y'all wasn't, y'all wasn't listening. Um, Jaguar Wright. She made a big thing. Now, her shit was just a little bit far blown. I still don't believe. I don't, like I said, this is all the allegations, man. And I ain't, you know what I'm saying? I don't believe. I, I, like I said, we don't know what to believe. Even with the murder of Tupac, we don't know what to believe. But Diddy got a lot of allegations out here. And then we come back to not with, with, with not just with Cassie, man, but Kim Porter is, you know, is, is a baby mom. Yeah. You know, it was a lot of things they was trying to say about that, like, you know, with her, you know, situation. I ain't even going to go into all that. He had that. a couple of chicks come out the woodwork that, but no, that they, had said he, he had abused them. Not shit. abused, but I know that they were saying in, 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 in no, the thing abuse, that man. Kim Porter had a book that was coming up that was supposed to reveal some stuff about, you know, his his life. Is you know, you know, a lot of these things, you know, they said about Diddy Fars, you know, like private parties, I would say, and, you know. Man, you know that's what I'm saying. Not only Crazy. do he got the murder, not Close. only do he got the 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 pause worthy stuff. He got the stuff with Cassie. Now he talking about rape and 
Diddy been all over the place. He just invited DJ Academics over to the crib, man. Come back to the spot. That's another one. That's another one. Diddy, you a hot boy right now. Pause, bro. You got to. Hey, bro, you let your son shine and sit down for a little minute, brother love. Put some put some uh, <laughs> some focus on old boy man uh, King Combs man. Yeah man, cause boy you gon you gon dance your way right in the jail nigga. For real bro, <laughs> take like that, take that. But I don't, I mean we gonna spend a little second on this though for a second you know for real cause I want to know how you feel about that. Do you feel like Cassie man coming out right now is like is it for clout? I ain't gonna say it's for clout cause obviously something that happened there so she can feel whatever way she wants to cause it happened to her. I mean, only if she got a book or album coming out, if we decided to fuck That's what it feels like. You know what I'm saying? But if I if I see an album roll out after this, oh, nah, you ain't man. Gonna see no album, man. You never know. And then she married, too. So it's kind of like that shit sat with you that long. And, and, and shout, shout out Cassie, man. Nothing. If that's what happened, that's what happened. She has a right to sue him. Cassie or, dropped an album, though, bro. Cassie dropping I'm album. just, I don't know what she doing. Andre D. Thousand dropping an album. So, hey, anything possible. Yeah, so, well, crazy. it's not really an album. But, um, but you got to <laughs> think about it, though. To go 12 to 15 years, bro, with the, that in you, you don't got married. All the niggas, you know, man. And then they trying to tie the Kid Cuddy when she was dating Kid Cuddy. They trying to tie, remember when his car blew up in the uh, uh. driveway? Allegedly, 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 man. Because like I said, these are all like the allegations that people are putting out online now. But keep cooking, man. Like, yeah, man. man. Like he, the car blew up in the driveway and then it just comes out that around that time he had said, you know, I blow that nigga shit up. He was crazy about Cassie, bro. He was you know what I'm saying? Him, so, you know, shit just don't be a coincidence. I just feel like what's done in the dark yeah. always going to come to the light. Yeah. And you know what else? I mean, and the smoke. Shh, always fire. Yeah. Shh. Yeah, man. Diddy, man, <laughs> tighten up, bro. I, I And really, bro, you know, I, hey, That's you know, crazy. back in the day, man, no shot to Diddy, man, you know, but Diddy, bro, tighten up, bro. You acting like you was when you had the dolphin teeth. I don't like that. Man. Um, Shit together, man. Yeah, man. Like I said, it's, a, you know, all allegedly, man, you know, right now. It's just like when you... Uh, <coughs> It's like this. I'm going to leave it alone, man. It's all allegedly. You know, it's all allegedly. We all know this. But at the same time, though, when it's like when somebody like continuously, like when the, when the rumor is around or when it's like this is like crowded your name or, it's, you know, your name is always evolved around this stuff for so long. And this is from everything that we just spoke on in the last, like, you know, I would say 10 minutes, whatever, or eight, eight nine minutes. It, it damn near like it, you know what I'm saying. It's damn near like you guilty before you you know what I'm saying. Even go to the, you know what I'm saying to the in front of a judge or something. I ain't gonna say you you guilty, but it's like you damn near like you got to prove yourself innocent because right now you're damn near guilty because you so many allegations of this same shit. It's like I don't, I'm not putting them with R. Kelly, but it's damn near like the same thing with R. Kelly. When R. Kelly, when uh when when the shit came back up, we was like nigga, oh you 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 guilty, bro. You so cooked. you cooked, yeah. So when this shit comes back up, like. Oh yeah, man. Um, you still doing that shit? You, 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 you like? Oh, you got the stuff with the whole, um, you know, I don't even, the parties. I'm just gonna say the parties. <laughs> these wild the parties. party parties. Yeah, these party parties and stuff. And then you got Aubrey, you know, and seeing like I've been telling y'all this shit. Man, you got Cassie, a person that we always thought that like, damn, bro, she don't say a fucking word. She hold that nigga down while he got Kim. Why he got, you know what I'm saying? This yeah, that, 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 that was that was like, I ain't gonna lie, that was she was the real definition of a side piece, nigga. I'm talking yeah. about stay quiet. So for her to pop out now and be like, oh yeah, this nigga raping me and uh this nigga uh sexually, I mean not sexually assault me, but assaulting me, you know, you know, physically abusing, you know what I'm saying? All this type shit, like Diddy? Brother Love? Brother Love. But man, bro. The nigga just dropped a peace project, man. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. She didn't dog. get her feet. Like, she didn't want that feet. You know that's I mean? like we. That's like when Kanye was dropping the, uh, the gospel album. We find out he just slapping Kim Kardashian around. Like, oh dang. Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like we ain't, we ain't, like Kanye, bro. Like we don't look at. We know Diddy get busy because if you remember back in the day, dog. Like Diddy get Diddy Diddy can get out here and get active. Like, I remember the J Cole shit. Y'all remember the J. Cole shit? Yeah, Diddy got a lot of instances of slapping these rappers up, bro. That's what I'm saying. Drake. Like, 
he slapped Drake? Man, uh, oh yeah, he did. Yeah, <laughs> nigga. Yeah. Come on, so man. that's Drake. That's J Cole. You know what I'm saying? And I, and I might be missing one. Like, yeah, man. Get active but out here, bro. Diddy will slap the shit out of y'all out there. Like, y'all be thinking, take that, take that, and party parties. That nigga will slap you with the hand of God, bro. <laughs> then, then he, like I said, then you putting the, uh, the Keefy D shit and all that in there, man. They, they saying this man out here sponsoring shit, so. Man, man, Puffy Shake back, man. If it ain't true, bro, you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm a Pac fan, so. But if it ain't true, man, yeah. damn, man. Get that shit off your name, man. Get that, get that mustard off your shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That mustard all in his jacket and pants and head. <laughs> Damn. But, uh, yeah. Tea. Fuck is they talking about? I took another ride. I got the bulls in the middle of my brothers. I got the whole city back. My 